What's up, WWE Champions Universe? This is Lee from Champions Chat, and this is your three-minute move set for Jimmy Uso, The Bloodline. You will notice I have the honorary Uso moment that does not impact anything except faction feud, and I do not have a strap on him whatsoever, so not only will yours hit harder, but specifically, if you have the Uso's cap plate, he will hit quite a bit harder because that does, whenever you make eight or more silence gems, increase your green gem damage by 150% for three turns. So, uh, yours will hit harder than this, but the, the move set, the go-to across the board is triple green. Uh, your open-handed uppercut deals damage plus five by five area to make silence. Your diving cro uh, corkscrew deal damage, make 13 silence gems into X break. And then your Samoan splash deal damage, choose a four by four area to swap into green gems. Uh, once you have all the moves loaded, I would just move from the silence to the finisher back to back uh, because you're going to buff your silence and green gem damage, especially with the Usos plate. So I've got Georgie Animal Steel for four more MP. I've got Booker on here for green gem damage at 12k. You could buff the silence gems with Rosie or someone like that. Uh, you could also buff the X break gems, but I think your silence gems with the plate are the play. Uh, and then Zombie Cody for silence gems do six. 60% more damage, and if you have them, Zombie Hogan for Silence Gems do 50% more damage. Again, since I'm not running a uh, plate or the Usos cap right now, you'll see far more damage uh, with your build, even if you don't have one of these coaches. Uh, so, let me show you how he works. Your finisher isn't going to be loaded turn one in most instances, so to begin, you're going to throw out your Silence Gems and then break the X. Or, if you have the ability to eat a turn, you can just do a green swipe because again, while the X break breaks more gems, your silence gems is what you're buffing and the green gems is where your extra damage comes from. So you want to do something where you can put uh, the silence gems down and then go straight into the 4x4 area of green to get the most amount of silence gem damage out of what you're doing. Uh, if you need the X breaks, you can throw them at any time. Once you have the Usos cap on there, you're going to hit quite a lot harder. And of course, if you were running Fury 2s, you would hit even harder again. So I'll show you that way, and then I'll show you with the X breaks in play, and you can see the damage. Also note, mine's only at 19K, so he's not very, even though he is six star, he's not even max six star. He's uh, pretty low level from, from there. So this you'll lay down where you hit some of the silence, some of the X breaks, you're gonna hit a lot of bound of the board, but you can see it's a, fra a flawless reload. <laughs> not flawless, flawless reload. Uh, and when you've got some of the tricks in there, he'll hit pretty hard. Great for boss battle. So that's your three minute move set for Jimmy Uso. Let me know what you think in the comments section. Like this video, subscribe to Champions Chat, and then share this with your friend or faction mate who's saying, uh, hey, this guy's required for a tour or a mode. How do you run him? I just got him any good. Here's how. I'll see you on the next one. Bye.